For the second time in less than a month, a hit and run driver has killed someone trying to cross Ferguson Road in Far East Dallas. Fox 4's Davidson Tendry live in Dallas with that story. David. Yeah, Blake, police do not have any video or photos of the crash to give us an idea of what happens. What we do know is that whoever hit the 33 year old did not stop. A deadly hit and run on Ferguson Road, just north of I-30 in Far East Dallas. Dallas police don't know who's responsible. No surveillance, no known witnesses. But somebody knows something. Somebody hit him. The driver killed Amanda Mayhem's boyfriend, Anthony Ryan. He was in bad shape. It was bad. Ryan lived in Missouri with Mayhem. They came to Dallas in November to stay with her sister following her father's death. They were staying a few blocks away from where Ryan was killed. He was walking alone to get cigarettes on December 12th after midnight. There's no cameras where Anthony was hit. There's no videos. Police say an unknown vehicle struck the 33 year old and didn't stop. He fought for nearly two weeks in a hospital. His leg was amputated and he suffered severe head trauma. He died on Christmas Eve. I understand it being an accident and being scared or whatnot, but you left a human being to die in the street alone. Nobody deserves that. Just weeks before Ryan was hit and three miles away on the same road, street racers struck and killed 73 year old Linda Pearson and her dog. That was the day after Thanksgiving. In that case, there was plenty of surveillance and two young men were arrested and charged. Just do the right thing. Part of Mayhem's pain is not knowing what led to Ryan's death. She wants someone who knows what happened to speak up. He didn't deserve any of that. If you have any idea what happened, we have posted contact information for Dallas PD investigators over on our website. That's fox4news.com.